that would be a big, big blooper. It would just be losing on the spot because the white knight would jump to c6 and after pawn takes knight, the rook comes up to the eighth row and once the king steps forward, the queen will deliver a checkmate on a6. Yeah, so actually one side is getting checkmated. If Magnus finds this move, which is, I've got to say, incredibly hard to see, he finds it. Wow. Whoa. If he finds this move, he's doing the checkmating. If he found, if he played any other move, he would have been checkmated. Wow. Uh, <laughs> Yovanka, you're right. This knight is coming in now. There's also the idea of some checks. There's also the black knight coming to take this pawn. Maybe white can't defend. And there again, we see the top computer move. Stockfish suggest suggesting white's bishop dropping back. That is incredibly hard. Any other move? Black wins on the spot, essentially. And uh, the first move that came to my mind was the rook shuffling across. This is the second best move for Stockfish. Uh, according to Stockfish, hitting the Black Queen. The Black Queen can move, though, with a check. And uh, when the White King runs out the way, which I think it has to do, I think Black can keep it simple now. There's still a threat of checkmate on the back rank, but Black can create some escape squares, taking a knight with check. And uh, another check. And, yeah. Black would win here because you can simply take the bishop on the next turn. Instead, Arjun has gone to capture the, this knight and Magnus, he's going to deliver checkmate. It's unstoppable now. Checkmate coming on this square or checkmate coming via the knight on this square. Two threats and the White King is doomed. Magnus Eric is going to win. Yeah, Eric Icy shakes his head. He can see that he's losing game number two as well. Is this due to some inaccuracies by him or is Magnus again playing incredible chess? I mean, we can't fault Eric Icy. Yes, he blundered, but it's from a human point of view, Magnus's move was just genius, right? Yeah. That, and to have calculated that, and there was such a narrow path as well. He forced Magnus to find like three or four only moves to win. Anything else, Eric Icy would have been winning. So he kind of gambled Eric Icy and uh, didn't pay off, but. And was it that wow. knight move by Magnus? There? And here we go. Yeah. Wow, Magnus Carlsen is up by two points now in the final. Eric Icy with the white pieces. He loses in 30 moves. 